I don't know about you, but I'm pretty stoked that Beetlejuice 2 is coming out in about a week. I love that original movie, and I can see that Michael Keaton and others, original actors, are in it too. If you're like me and you're on Reddit, kind of reading about what people are talking about around the movie, you might want to respond to somebody in a quote. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to quote somebody in Reddit so that if you respond within a, a thread, that people know what you're referencing. So we're going to do that on desktop, and then I'm going to show you how to do that on mobile, on an Android device. So right, so right here on this thread, someone said that Willem Dafoe isn't even an actor. He just keeps wandering onto different sets. So he can kind of just do whatever he wants. He's got that star power. So I want to quote that. Um, so I've I copied something in here. Willem Dafoe isn't even an actor. He just keeps wandering onto different sets. So I'd copy that there, and to quote it um, anywhere, whether it's in here or a different part of the thread, you would just click the rich editor text right there. So click rich text editor, and then you paste that in there in a response. It doesn't have to be right after the quote. It could be anywhere within this thread or anywhere on Reddit. You can just quote it, and then you click the quote right there, and you'll see a line appear next to it. So now people know when you're commenting that you're referencing that quote. So if you were to just type more text in here, like that, type something, it looks like it's still a quote. You don't want to do that because that's not the actual quote. So you're going to have to hit enter three times like this. One, two, actually only two times. So you hit enter two times, and that will get you to where you can put your own comments. So you can say like, I totally agree. Willem Dafoe can do whatever he wants. Like that, and then hit comment. So now that it's on there, people can see that you're quoting, you're including a quote and you're responding to that quote. Um, so you could put that anywhere on there. That's how you do it on desktop. Now we'll hop over to mobile and I'll show you how to do it there. All right, so now I'm on mobile on an Android, but same thing on iOS if you're in a browser. I'm just on the Chrome version. You can do this on the app too. So you can add a comment in there and include the quote. So I've copied this. All right, I'm going to copy that and then I'm going to add a comment with that quote. Um, so to add a quote, it's a little different here. There's not that quote button. You're going to have to put the little caret symbol like this, which I'll show you. So you go in there and you're going to put this symbol right there. So you put that little symbol, it's like a open greater than sign. And then you're going to paste in the quote. Um, and then that shows that it's a quote. And you'd say, I agree. 100, etc., and then you comment. So, as you can see, after I clicked enter, it put that line there. Um, so, it's saying that I agree with this quote. That's how you do it. You just add a comment in anywhere. Same thing um, if you're on iOS, just using the same version. Remember, you put that little greater than caret symbol in. So, that's how you quote somebody on Reddit. It's important to do that because if you don't, um, then you may put a comment in and maybe out of context, someone may think that you're commenting on something else. Um, so just keeping the conversation and the communication real is important. I hope you're stoked for Beetlejuice too, like I am. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you liked it, give it a like and subscribe to our channel. We'll see you again soon.